So you excited about it? Oh, it's just an honor. Have the privilege to work with Coach Mitchell again. We had so much fun the uh, the first time. Had the uh, chance to uh, restore this program and to work with Coach Butts and Coach Dunn. This is going to be an amazing experience. Quite a relationship with Coach Butts, right? I think I read you played together. How's that going to help you? Well, I think just great team chemistry. You know, we trust each other. We've known Coach Mitchell for over 20 years, the respect that we have for Coach Dunn. Um, and we can tell the kids stories. We were once in college, had a great time, a great experience at Tennessee, and we'll bring that here. How much experience did you gain while coaching at Tennessee that you can bring to this job? It was an amazing experience, you know, learned so much from Coach Warlick, the staff, the opportunity to uh, just bring the championship and winning ways to Kentucky um, is what I look forward to doing. The, the obvious thing is, of course, they was asking about, about the, the, the woes the program's been having and, and, and what was your reaction to, to taking that on, to come in taking this job with all of the negative things that have been going on? Well, you know, we just have to turn the negative into a positive. Uh, we have work to do. Uh, we can't go anywhere but up from here. Um, but I think Coach Mitchell has uh, a great staff around him. He's an amazing coach, a people person, and I think people will see the excitement of Kentucky women's basketball again soon. Are you, what, what kind of response are you getting from people, or whether it's your recruits or whomever, and, 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 and how, how are you combating any, any concerns that they have? Well, I just think being honest, you know, this is what happened, this is how we're dealing with it, but giving them a roadmap of this is how we're moving forward. This is the staff, and this is where we see you and how you can help us in the future. What's your impression of the, the staff as a unit early on here and what, how this how you all work together? Well, yesterday was our first day all in the <laughs> office together, so it's been okay. great. Um, we've had and it was a great day and a half. Uh, so far, so good. Uh, but I will tell you, we have a group text message, and it goes off all day long. So when people were out of town or still trying to transition to here, we have great communication skills with each other. I do know that much so far. How do you feel about working with Matthew again? What's that like? You know, Matthew's like a brother to me. We have a great chemistry on and off the court. Uh, we have a trust, a communication, um, great communication with each other. So we're family. So um, we'll have our ups and downs, but it, it will be all for the best in, in, in getting this program to where it needs to be. The experience you've had the last at Tennessee, how has the dynamic changed and what you may bring to the table working with Matthew the second time around? Uh, I think working with him uh, the second uh, time around, I think we have a, a new appreciation for each other uh, after being away from each other uh, for four years. I always respected him as a man, as a coach, as a person. I uh, respect him so much more now that I've had time to be away from him and the things that I admire about him, and I think that will uh, strengthen our relationship the second time around.